Good evening guys. Happy Tuesday to all of your sunshiny faces. I am actually in my bed right now guys because I don't feel like moving. <laughs> I am. The Cubs game started so late tonight. I think it started like 9 o'clock. So it is almost midnight. I am exhausted. I got so much stuff done for today and I was up so early this morning too. I also kind of went to bed a little late last night even though I was trying to get to bed earlier. I woke up though at before my alarms went off actually at eight o'clock. So I was at probably, I think my alarm actually goes off at 7.50. And so I give myself about 10 minutes to hit the snooze button. That's normally never how it goes though. I normally hit the snooze button like 50 times and then it turns into like nine, 10 o'clock <laughs> get up. Um, sometimes later than that, sometimes the alarm just turns itself off because I've hit snooze so many times or just because it's going and I haven't even hit snooze because I sleep right through it sometimes. But today I was up. Like I said, probably around like 7.45 this morning. And so got up, me and Jack ended up going for a walk. Actually, I did a load of dishes before we even went for our walk because Jack normally has his breakfast before we go walking. I normally eat my breakfast after. So I just decided I was gonna do a load of dishes. I actually think maybe I did a load of laundry too before we even left. I am so sore though today, guys, from gardening. Um, and like, it, it's a good kind of sore though, like good muscles kind of sore. Surprisingly, I was expecting my legs to be really sore. They were not. And it was just like, my shoulders hurt so bad um not my shoulders like my whole upper arm kind of was what hurt was hurting just kind of surprised because a lot of times when I garden it's normally like my forearms kind of hurt um but this was like up here like at the top so I was like I wonder what I was doing like how I was like trying to pull stuff out or weed stuff or whatever and that it that was like what was the sore part and thankfully though my neck and my back which have been bothering me kind of recently were not bothering me like at all yesterday or today like or even sore really after I mean like I feel general soreness kind of like everywhere but like I said surprisingly it's not like oh my gosh my neck is so stiff like I can't move today like I felt pretty much okay for the most part so um like I said I got that done I don't know at some point I started doing laundry too I ended up actually washing all my bedding which is why I'm in bed because I'm like I'm it smells so good and I'm so comfy in here right now I'm just gonna stay in bed so I decided like I said I was gonna wash all my bedding actually that was after I had my breakfast um so I started washing all my bedding and then I also put I had a basket a laundry basket full of clothes I needed to put away so I put the clothes away I also needed to clean off my desk I ended up doing that this was all before I cleaned the bathroom too today then I ended up cleaning the bathroom um and got all of that done and like deep clean like shower toilet sink windows you know a uh, mirror clean the floors uh mop the floors vacuumed like all that stuff um so that all got done then like I said too I was working on laundry throughout the day like as soon as I could I would throw in another load because my bedding I have to wash in like a couple different loads just because there's so much of it a lot of times too I end up re having to reuse like I, I do have other like pillowcases and stuff like that but for like my body pillow or like my other like crescent body pillow kind of thing I don't I don't have like well I do have a second body pillow cover but um the like crescent body pillow that I have I don't have like a backup pillowcase for it so when I wash it I have to make sure that that one's washed and ready like you know the same day same with my comforter too like I have to wash that and use it in the same day because I don't have another comforter to put on my bed um and again too like it's so warm out right now like my window's open I don't really even need a comforter but I have been snuggling up more with my like I haven't been warm when I've been sleeping because the window's been open and also too because they furnace has not been going like it's so much warmer in my room when the furnace is going than any other part of the house which is why the furnace is going so much but my room because I keep the door closed and everything like that it is and it's the most interior room it gets so warm in here but because it hasn't been going it's actually been very cool in my room plus on top of that too I've had my window open so like even though Jack has his window open too it feels cooler kind of in my room I'm more comfortable sleeping under my blankets and like under my comforter at night again too I finished that finished the laundry, put the bedding back on the bed. I ended up also too, while I was eating my breakfast, I also uploaded this morning as well. Like I said too, all the other stuff I got to cleaned off my desk, put the laundry away, did all that stuff, um, which was on my planner for today. So I got all that done. Like I said, it, it had been a long day already. Then my dad ends up telling me that he had talked to our contractor. He had said that this week was 
pretty free for him that he could come pretty much any time to do that little drywall patching stuff that has to be done in the back room and that um, I think a different day he's going to come to do the floor stuff but the drywall he's going to end up doing that first like I said I think he's going to do it like in chunks or whatever so um, or he is at least going to put the drywall stuff up that needs to be done and then probably end up sanding it like a different day um, so like I said I don't know entirely what that involves or anything like that but um what i realized was that everything that is in that back room which is also where my closet is currently needs to be moved out of there because um like again too i'm assuming that he's not doing any of the the sanding which is the very messy part but in addition to that though even just like cutting the drywall and, like that kind of stuff can get pretty messy and so even though there is doors like on my closet i do not want to have to wash rewash my clothes if you know like I said there's some type of drywall dust or anything like that that ends up you know blowing through you know like underneath the door or whatever because they're just like sliders so I don't like I said I don't want to have to deal with that so again too my dad is like oh well we like he called him today and then he ended up he was like okay well let me find out well like what works for everybody else so like I guess he just talked to my mom and then texted him back and was like oh any day is fine you know whatever um, and I think I said that too though. He did mention it, but then my mom has something going on in the morning tomorrow So he's coming like afternoon I think around noon or maybe a little after that something around there I'm thinking oh like, you know, it probably won't be tomorrow that he's coming But no it is he's coming tomorrow And so now I needed to get all of my clothing moved from the back bedroom closet into the primary bedroom Which will be my future bedroom But because again too, I think I told you guys this room doesn't have a closet in here So I used the one that used to be my my mom's office which was the back like bedroom kind of thing so because of that though I'm switching closets because my parents still had had stuff in the primary room but we're gonna have to move all the stuff out of the primary room when we do redo the floors and paint in there so it just like again too it makes sense to like move it now and then I have to be moved back and then Jack's gonna move out of there into the smaller room and then eventually that the primary room will be done and then I'll be moving from this room into that room and then we'll finish this room and redo it for Jack and then he's going to come in here and then we'll finish the other I guess move the furniture into the other bedroom in the back that needed to get done so we ended up finishing that got all that stuff moved around like last minute kind of tonight and then also too we had to move the pictures my aunt's pictures which were in that back room um that need to, to be moved out of there and moved back into the living room because I didn't have a ton of time last week to work on them and I didn't have any time at all so far this week because obviously today might have actually been a little bit busier than yesterday but I've had like a hundred things going on between gardening yesterday and then like I said cleaning the bathroom today and then all of the other little things that I had going on it's been like so much stuff <laughs> so um again too and then like adding more on that I didn't realize like also had to be done because I was like okay well one of the days too I think I may have even mentioned that yesterday I think I said like oh well one of the days when it's like gonna rain which is gonna be Thursday or Friday I'm, maybe I'll try and get to you know moving like that stuff around since it will be you know like raining outside I can't work in the garden so that was kind of my plan I think was to do more of the inside stuff like on those two days and I think that was one of the things that I was thinking of like oh moving the clothes or whatever not thinking like oh he might be coming one day during this week so like I said there has been so much stuff going on and um today has just been a very like not busy but just like I've had a lot of stuff to do and like a lot of stuff that I wanted to get done I didn't actually have plans and I didn't even write in my planner to clean my bedding but I had sheets that were clean that I had the intention of putting on the bed and so they were in my basket full of stuff I need to put away so I was like let's just wash everything else so I like switched the sheets out with the ones that were clean instead of just like washing them and then just putting them back on the bed so I used like the new clean sheets and then ended up washing the other stuff like I said the comforter and like pillowcases and stuff like that but again too to go through <laughs> wash all that stuff and then oh like I said it was just been a long day and other stuff too that I wasn't planning on it didn't have in my plan but today was supposed to be more like my rest day after like gardening because my plan was to then go tomorrow and garden as well which I don't know that's that's gonna happen because if he's coming in around noon I don't know that I will necessarily get out to the garden but my goal is still to do it so my thought is is that if me and Jack can get up early again tomorrow go walking hopefully early in the morning 
get back and then hopefully maybe I can weed like the front flower bed and get that done and just pull up most of the dead stuff too because there's not a ton of weeds that are really up yet um but it was a lot of like clearing out a lot of the dead plants from last year and like leaves and like that kind of stuff so that's my plan for tomorrow and um I still want to try and do that so I'm thinking like again to like maybe just have like quick breakfast and then try and get to you know again doing all the other stuff that I wanted to do anyway and like had on my planner to do anyway so again too because Thursday and Friday I can't if it's gonna rain um, but I don't know like Thursday it might rain like in the evening in which case it might be okay because it's like a very small percentage on Thursday and then higher on Friday so it might be like raining like Thursday night into Friday in which case I could possibly like on Thursday but I also don't like I said want to risk it if I have really nice weather out where like I'm comfortable and I'm not like dripping sweat like working outside like yesterday again too I wasn't I was just dirty because it was muddy but it wasn't like that bad like you know hot and like I'm just just to dripping sweat afterwards because of how you know like hot it is outside or like anything like that so that's why I would really love to work outside and get to some of this stuff earlier and that might not be an option tomorrow but we'll see so anyways like I said I'm so tired so much stuff got done today which is awesome but it's also exhausting <laughs> so um like I said maybe tomorrow will be more my rest day because in addition to that too if I am going to be working outside side and our contractor is going to be here somebody kind of needs to be with the dogs to keep them quiet they're gonna have to be locked up somewhere and it's a little bit easier they tend to not get as riled up if they're split up so like if jack has like bravo and maybe bliss they'll be quieter and if i have just have charlie versus if like all three of them are just in one person's bedroom because we have to keep him locked up because he'll be like coming in and out and stuff like that but they especially too like if they don't know who is in the house they think it's a stranger they'll just bark and <laughs> so so to keep them quiet we'll keep them with us and then but again too they will still bark sometimes even if they're with us and so it's easier if we split them up because then they tend to be quieter but if he is going to be here earlier in the day I don't want to leave them all with Jack and then like I don't know how long this is going to take tomorrow so like maybe I possibly would have a chance after he's like done doing some of the work and then be able to do some of the gardening but like I said I just don't want to leave Jack with the, all the dogs tomorrow too and everything so I don't know we'll see maybe Thursday's an option too um but again too I feel like I got so much stuff done in just these two days that I don't want to be like oh, okay well like that's good enough kind of thing I really want to keep trying to get stuff done but again too it's just how feasible is it for tomorrow I'm not entirely sure um so like I said we'll see I would also not mind if I tried to do because I know the front flower bed will probably take a while one of the other ones might not be quite as long so maybe we could see if I could squeeze it in somehow but either way, like I said, we'll have to figure that out if that ends up working out for tomorrow or not. Obviously, I will let you guys know, but I'm going to finish. Actually, the Cubs game just ended. I'm going to real quick see if I can edit maybe one more video. I at least got one done while I was watching the Cubs game tonight. So like I said, it ended up, you know, started really late. So it's late and I'm like well I could either go to bed finish watching the Cubs game and lay here and possibly fall asleep or I could try and edit and keep myself awake at least which is what I did so like I said I might try and get to one more just so I have two edited so I can upload them because I normally do them in twos anyway so um like I said I'll see if I can get to that and if not maybe just take a shower and go to bed because like I said it's almost midnight or I think it is midnight right now <laughs> and I got up so early I'm ready for bed and I deserve nice night rest tonight but anyways if you guys did enjoy today's vlog make sure you guys give a big old thumbs up if you guys are new we'd love if you'd subscribe and i'll see all of your sunshiny faces tomorrow so bye guys